So what do politicians actually mean when they talk about parental rights? And why is it a dangerous dog whistle that we should be wary of ahead of the next American and Canadian elections? So parental rights is a buzzy phrase in conservative circles right now. And a video of Conservative Party of Canada leader Pierre Polyev defending parental rights is making the rounds on social media. And right-wing advocacy groups are already flagging parental rights as a key issue in the 2024 American presidential election. And sure, at first glance, it all seems innocent. Parents, they have rights. But in recent years, parental rights has actually become a dangerous buzzword in anti-trans and anti-queer rhetoric. So talking legally, parental rights refer to the rights and responsibilities that parents have towards their children. You know, the responsibility to provide housing, the right to make certain decisions for their kids. Parental rights come up often in the context of things like custody after divorce. But lately, the phrase and idea has been weaponized as part of the anti-trans movement as so-called parental rights come into conflict with the ways that kids interact with gender and sexuality. 